Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. This is Normal here and let's talk about the Glyph interface on the Nothing Phone 2. So Nothing Phone 2, just like the Nothing Phone 1, has one uh, interesting speciality and that's the Glyph light. Now what is Glyph light? It's uh, the lights or rather the LED available on the back panel just like the Nothing Phone 1. Now uh, Nothing has improved the Glyph lights and made it uh, more usable and uh, there are a lot of additional features also added to the Glyph light making it even better than the Nothing Phone 1. Now Nothing Phone 1 uh, did have option uh, to take selfies, uh, even use it as a torch. So there are some options like a notification and ringtones you can set. So those were available on the Nothing Phone 1. Now that has been carried forward uh, here as well. But apart from that, you can also use the Glyph LED uh, for other features as well. So what are the features? Let's find out. So before getting into the video, if this is your first time on this channel, do hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish. So let's begin. So you can see that this is the Glyph LED and these are made better uh, with uh, the new version. This is the nothing phone too and you can see that uh, the pattern is more or less similar you have around the camera there is one here and uh, around the wireless charging pad and here also you can see here now let's uh, go to the software and uh, see what uh, new features it offers so let's just take the settings uh, and uh, here you can see that glyph interface so just select this glyph interface and you can see here there are plenty of options available the first option is how you want the light to be there are three options one is automatic uh, lights and then uh, you have the option to turn off the automatic and then select the the different levels so there are three levels the first second and third so third is the most powerful of the lot and uh, you can see that it is very powerful and if you want automatic mode you can go with that as well additionally you have this uh, ringtone so you can select uh, the ringtones you can add custom uh, contacts and you can select uh, uh, different people and you can select the ringtone for them so that that option now was available uh, uh, previously as well each nothing ringtone has a unique glyph pattern so pair the ringtone to individual contacts to know who is calling even on silent mode so what it does is if you have a person say uh, your relative or your parents or your wife you want to have a special uh, uh, glyph pattern you can set it based on that contacts now third is the notification now we, we have the default sound so these are the notification available so there are different options available you can also enable uh, sound only if you don't want uh, the uh, uh, or rather if you want only the sound uh, glyph light will be disabled that is option option is also there then now uh, we have uh, some options available so here can see here some options you can also use the glyph composer we'll come back to that then there is a new option called add new essential so you can uh, enable essential uh, notifications say for example uh, you are using instagram a lot and if you want uh, uh, to be notified someone uh, messages you on instagram or sends you a direct message so for example i just select uh, instagram you get plenty of options instagram direct instagram direct request video chat alerts say for example like uh, someone uh, uh, messages me on instagram direct I can set here so there is a new essential set so whenever somebody uh, messages me on Instagram I get uh, this notification and this notification will be there till I actually see that notification so that's the essential notification then now uh, you can enable or disable glyph LED then flip to glyph uh, silence uh, on demand uh, so this is option uh, we just have to flip the device and it will go to the silent mode I'll just show you so I just flip the device and now it's gone to the silent mode now only when i take uh, the uh, phone out uh, the silent mode will be off so when uh, the flip uh, is available you can see that uh, only the light will glow and there won't be any sound because it's uh, in mute so that's one of the things uh, flip to mute is very interesting and very uh, useful feature all you need to do is just uh, flip the device and it will go to the uh, mute option so next is the glyph timer so you can also set a timer uh, using the glyph uh, this uh, this will be the one so I've just set a 30 second timer and I'll just go here and uh, so there you go I just uh, flip to start I just started the glyph timer and uh, 30 second uh, it will you can see here the pattern coming down uh, this is the countdown timer so uh, based on amount of the time you have set uh, the glyph uh, will come down and eventually turn off when the timer is off so you can see here now it's coming down because it's a 30 second timer for demonstration purpose you can see it is coming down and once the 30 second is over uh, it will uh, the glow will go off so that's how you can set the timer uh, using the glyph led so this is a pretty good option 
see now you can see that uh, the timer is off and uh, you can see the notification now one new feature is the composer so uh, you can see that uh, uh, the composer is something which uh, is quite good so this is the composer this is the glyph composer so you can see this button uh, once you start this uh, you can use this pad uh, to create a new ringtone i'll just show you so i just starting recording So I just created a ringtone. So I just save it. So the ringtone which I have created is now available. So I can use this ringtone as uh, my ringtone for the phone. So this is the Glyph Composer. So you can use a variety of options to create your own uh, ringtone. And uh, you can uh, enable it. And uh, once you are set selected, you can uh, choose this as the ringtone uh, for your notifications. You can see here, you, can, you have the option to choose. So Glyph Composer you can see that two of the uh, ringtones are now available so this is how you can uh, use the glyph composer uh, to um create your own ringtone now there is also volume indicator so whenever i uh, increase or decrease the volume so you can see here this is how the volume uh, increase or decrease works once again if i increase it you can see here the full volume then uh, google assistant also you can use uh, for this uh, and uh, apart from that there is also charging meter uh, whenever you charge this is the one which glows so when you charge uh, we had shown in the charging video as well so this is how it works so this is the charging indicator then we have a third party uh, integration right now it's available only for uber so if you are using uber you can uh, see this is the one uh, which shows uh, the time uh, to uh, for the cab to reach that is available it's as a third party integration then you can also disable glyph led because uh, uh, for a particular time say for example if you are going to bed you can disable the glyph led because you don't want to be disturbed with light uh, so you can disable that so these are the options in the glyph led available on the nothing phone 2 so there are plenty of options compared to the nothing phone 1 so uh, they are making it better definitely by the next titration it will be more and more useful and apart from that you can also use the glyph led for uh, flash uh, you can see here uh, the flash can be also be used uh, this is already available uh, so this is nothing new and you can also use it as uh, different options uh, for notifications so that was how the glyph led works on the nothing phone too hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day